This mission comes at the behest of House Redditch, one of Alatane's oldest families. This prestigious family has had a strong association with Southfield for a long time and currently finds itself in crisis. It seems the Daglant's Traders' Union, their former affiliates, has raised the flag of rebellion and they're now embroiled in a bitter conflict. How dare those traders bite the hand that feeds them? Assisting nobles, are we? Not my cup of tea, but I suppose this kind of thing can't be allowed. House Redditch has long maintained an intimate relationship with the royal government. They prop up the commerce of the entire region. Duke Hende is helping House Redditch in order to have them in his debt. Isn't that so? That's the way of it, yes. Now you must make for the Redditch estate without delay. Lady Walter Quinn Redditch, who brought this request to our unit, is due to take you there herself. Lady Walter Quinn, if you would be so kind. Greetings, everybody. My name is Walter Quinn Redditch. Forgive my intrusion. I had to flee Southfield at a moment's notice. I should be glad to escort you to the Redditch estate myself. I will do what I can to assist you in any way. You have our thanks, but your assistance won't be needed. Those traders and any of that Southfield rabble are ruffians. This will be a good opportunity to bring them to heel. Very well. All is clear. Then if you could prepare to depart at once, please. Central field cell swords, are ya? What have you dogs come here for? You are from the Daglands Traders' Union, correct? Curse you, Zachariah. You cozied up to my dear father only to betray him. Have you no shame? <laughs> well, if I ain't young Lady Redditch, so quick to find new islands. Where are the lady? It is not too late to come to an agreement. You should stand down if you value your lives. Stand down, you must be taking the mick. Come on, lads, let's get to work. Well, well, if it isn't the government's flea-ridden hands coming to foul our turf. There doesn't seem to be any prospect of negotiation. We will have to make a stand here. The barricades should hold against some of their attacks, but they won't last very long. We mustn't allow the enemy to reach the mansion. It won't be easy. They'll attack in great numbers. Brace yourselves. So far, so good. It up. I've got it. Go. Ahead. 
think you can escape. Very well. No! Back to the tap. Another one down. All according to plan. There's only a handful of them. Split up for a pincer attack. They've regrouped to approach us from two directions. We can take out one group and then the other, or split up and attack both at once. Choose whatever tactics you think best. Onwards. Here, a bit of healing for you. Very well. Zachariah and his henchmen. Shouldn't be too much trouble. Wait. Something doesn't feel right. <laughs> what the? The dead have risen. The fallen dead have risen once more. Why are they attacking their Daglan's comrades? More of them are coming this way!
take you down. Next time. On my way. Target eliminated. Go. Very well. Next target. We're gravely outnumbered. I fear we'll be. Do not lose spirit. There are no more corpses after these. We must hold out. On my way. Understood. Take you down. Target eliminated. On my way. Next target. Another one down. All according to plan. Zachariah is nowhere to be seen. Was he perhaps able to flee? The undead attack gave him the chance to evade us and evade interrogation. There doesn't seem to be any signs of life. Do you know where your family are, Lady Walter Quinn? They sent me away when the danger became apparent. I don't know what has become of them. We'll check the house, but I don't think we'll find anyone alive in there. No survivors, regrettably. Perhaps they suffered the same fate as the traders. Hmm. We must discover what caused the dead to rise like that. What do you mean? They're just monsters, aren't they? Fred, tell me what monster materializes like that. No, this is some yet unknown phenomenon. Or a scheme of man. Lady Walter Quinn. Any insights for us? Hmm. I do not. And yet you do possess considerable power, milady. Is ancient sorcery passed down through your house? No, there's no such sorcery in House Redditch, to my knowledge. I acquired my powers during my time in the church. During your time in the church? Is that so? Walter Quinn, if you've nowhere else to go, would you perhaps join our unit? Oh, yes. What on earth are you proposing? She's nobility, through and through. <laughs> I gratefully accept your offer, my dear Andreas Ronderson. Yes. Well, I wasn't expecting this. Hmm. The unit's latest recruit is the adept magicker, Lady Walter Quinn, the sole surviving member of the prestigious House Redditch. Many thought her unsuitable for mercenary life, given her aristocratic background. But she quickly proves her value in battle, gaining the trust of Frederick and Andreas. House Redditch had many unofficial ties to the land-owning nobility of Centralfield. 
and these connections were said to have given them the ear of the Lord's Council. This ten-man organization is a powerful body made up of officials selected from powerful families. Its role is to serve the kingdom by advising the king. Each Lord Counselor also leads a faction made up of lower nobles who seek their protection. The unit returned from Southfield to find a request waiting for them from Biltar Village. <laughs> 